Vibrio cholerae is a comma-shaped bacterium that causes cholera. Like most Vibrio bacteria, it is extremely mobile and moves and multiplies at great speed in water. The Vibrio hides in the stools of healthy carriers, as well as the sick and convalescent. It can linger in the body like this for 7 to 14 days. In endemic areas, healthy carriers far exceed the number of people actually suffering from the disease. So humans are both breeding grounds and a means of spreading the Vibrio. By drinking water contaminated with human feces carrying cholera, we can unknowingly invite an entire army of Vibrios into our stomachs. In most cases, people carrying the Vibrio show no symptoms, either because the cholera bacterium cannot survive the acid conditions in the stomach, which act as a barrier, or because the immune system has fulfilled its role. Contamination also depends on quantity, as vast amounts of Vibrios must be ingested for someone to get sick. After passing through the stomach, the Vibrio multiply in the small intestine and secrete a toxin, which provokes a series of biochemical reactions. This results in watery diarrhea, sometimes called rice water stools, and severe vomiting. These initial symptoms appear between a few hours and a few days after ingesting the bacteria. Dehydration can be dramatic. An infected person can lose up to 15 liters of fluid a day, which results in the loss of essential micronutrients, a sharp drop in blood pressure, and death. As the bacterium stays in the body for only a short time, it is more important for the doctor to focus on rehydrating the patient than attempting to get rid of the Vibrio. Patients recover incredibly fast, sometimes within hours, having literally been at death's door. 